Hello everyone, my name is Lanceo90 and welcome back to Let's Play Crusader Kings 2 The Reapers Do. Apologize ahead of time if we hear weird noises while we're playing. The neighbors are being loud. <laughs> anyway, it's been another day for me. Uh, it looks like we're raiding right now. Francius, way too fucking big. They're way too big. I had a. I guess I had a dream where they fell apart last night. That tells you I've been playing this game too much. I had a dream that they fall apart. Uh, viciously slandering me. And I'm gonna stay out of factions. Time to arrest him. Oh no, it wasn't the it wasn't the king who did it. It was someone else. He has acted disharmly toward me. No one will care. But at the same time, he'll be act as a you, an act of tyranny. Uh, we need to fix that. It's a council. He's lost control if there's a council or not. Which issue the council is allowed to influence? Yeah, we need to feudalize. We're almost there. Already have a son. I have to declare one more lord, one more war on Scotland. No, actually, it looks like two more. Actually, no, just one. One more. To the boats. Uh, where should we raid next? That place there is always pretty, pretty good to raid. Uh, prisoners. Let's see if we had any valuable prisoners. Doesn't seem like it. My generals and their understanding of warfare is so lacking compared to my own. I could teach Jarl Abstorn a thing or two. Is that another moralizer or another siege? Siege is pretty good. I'm uh, trying to prove perfect. Not the first thing. Or siege leaders is good because, like, even if they're not in command of one of my personal armies, as they spawn up in my allied armies, they'll just siege things down faster, which is awesome. Look at me with a new way lately, giggling and whatever I talk to her, laughing at things that are not meant to be funny. Seems she's infatuated with me. Eh, some little girl is creepy. Found the X. Our martial skill is actually not trashed here anymore. No, it still is. It's still level 9. Let's see. It's at plus 10% right now. And a martial score of 12. So 10% for every 2 points, I guess. So if I do lose it, I think I will go down to negative 10%. Maybe time to try a stewardship again to try to just level that up. Oh, young Thomas has finished his education in the ways of faith and learning and noticed with pride that he's obtained nothing left than a magical knowledge of skill. 
Not exactly the best to have high learning. It's not the end of the world. This is our air, so this is why it's kind of important to check what's going on. It's ambitious, just gives him a bunch of points. It's gonna make him uh, have trouble with other people who are ambitious, though. Erudite, turns his life on. Good at learning, and his diplomacy and martial isn't trash. As a intrigue could use some work though, which is funny because I think we are intrigue focused. I guess we can only choose build a war chest. He's unmarried. We'll be feudalizing soon. about. Just about she got a lot of minor traits. I don't know, he might accept it. He would actually access, accept that Croatia. Are they strong enough for us to want to do that? It's just risky doing that because he's such a minor nation, he might just get conquered by the Byzantine or Lombardy, which is also getting bigger than I'd like it to be. Maybe Lombardy and Francia will get in the fight here soon, that would be good. Queen of Bulgaria. Some weird stuff going on here. to anyone. There's the one who's strong enough, really. That would accept, at least. I can't connect, communicate with them, they're too far away. Hmm. I think we don't worry about it. We have other things to take care of. Getting the rest of our de jure territory feudalizing and then just kind of building up. Because I think we're going to have to go to war with France to do something to break them up. Where's my spy master? What's my spy master doing? They're not a very good spy master. Yeah, I have to send this Jarl away so I can get this good spy master here. She's actually attractive. She has lovers box. I think this is one of the spy masters we had before, probably. And then I fired her because she wouldn't vote for the thing I wanted. change from how it used to be. Unless I'm thinking of a, a martial ability. Might be thinking of feudal vassal things. But it's like, uh... I think there used to be one that was like... Uh... Incite Uprising. That's what I want to do over there. Well, that might be European Universalis 4, not this one. Uh, let's see. Almost taking care of our religious, religious trouble. Man. Of 
course, I think the I think the Catholics and Muslims should be fighting here soon as well, declaring crusades on each other. Of course, they can also declare crusades on us. That's kind of why we need to feudalize. I still can't believe we won that other war as soon as our as soon as our kid came to age. It was actually shocking that I won that. Uh, how much more money? Yeah, quite a bit I can get in there. Not gonna fight Rome. I'll just do some surface raiding. Ah, this guy has a lot of surface money. Where's it go? King of Finland has usurped. I don't like him usurping too many titles, but... You increased... Prosperity and gas there. That's why. I thought he'd increase the building speed. Uh, is there anything left to surface raid? Yes. King of Lithuania. Yes. I, uh, I have to keep in mind the option of uh, just becoming a world power. Instead of trying to keep some out of your territory. Oh no, I want to continue the game into the uh, U4 though. Although I think I kind of borked it by uh, leaving the Aztec invasion on. I probably should have left it off and then they would have fought Francia. Keep friends with him, please, it's very important. More important than you could ever imagine. Oh, uh, kind of prisoners. No one wants to free these prisoners. Um, you want to die, old man? away from losing our uh, ends on April next year so we can do that soon Sorry for finding you from the council, but you're trashed here. There's some commanders. Let's see who I have right now available. Oh, you would be good at you the guy who's angry at me, so... Kinda sucks, but... What are you gonna do? Everyone else is trashed here. Let's see what we can get. Commander. <laughs> really? Get him out of here. Like the worst character I've ever ever I have ever seen. You're pretty good. Take a penalty somewhere. Defender. I shall make him a commander. Good enough for me. Don't you work me? I can't capture that last territory. Training grounds.
a great plot. Let's do that. Hardly wait. And sacrifice time. Some random courtier that I don't really care about. Do it. Uh, where's the blessed version now? I guess there's just a limit of how many people you can sacrifice, because I don't think it's, I've ever, like, executed millions and millions of people. Uh, free the kid. Oh, she's from, uh country here. The Kingdom of Debarth. Thousands of opinion. Can do this one. I don't know what to do with the rest of these these other two. I don't know what like influences whether or not they can be sacrificed or not. Until next time. Oh yeah, truce is expiring. I could claim Lithuania. <laughs> Conquest of this little thing. Orkney. Two point six K troops don't have enough for a tribal army. I don't either, but I have a lot more troops than this. Could raise my allies if I wanted. I guess I will. I don't think they'll do much about it, but Rest of my men. I thought I had a crap ton. Do I own territory I'm not aware of? Ah, these threat. I don't know why those guys got on their boats. different boats. Uh, hold on. Let's see, I'm gonna need one stack that's 44 boats and one stack that's 32 boats.
subject has converted. Good, good. Poor physician has shared some of his latest ideas with me and do not know much of medicine, but perhaps he is onto something. So that's for many to develop his theory third and write a book on it. Of course, thanks for the medicine, but it fits us all. Sudden army. He's actually going for the attack here. I do have low morale there, but he did a straight crossing. Wow, and all my all my allies landed on me. As the enemy draws near during the battle, an uncontrollable rage begins to swell within you. You furiously bite down on the edges of your shield and attempt to devour it. Trembling with anger, you then raise your great axe and charge, howling in, into the enemy ranks. Many of the cowards attempt to flee at the mere sight of you, but your axe has no mercy to spare for them. Must kill more, Zerker. Character works himself into a mad frenzy during battle, charging furiously at the enemy. Plus four martial, minus two diplomacy. Personal combat skill plus three personal opinion. What's really good, I have a feeling that it might be reckless and you'll get murdered in the face for doing it, but. to send land to anyone who asks. I should be leading this. Excuse me? Where am I at? I'm leading troops and goddamn it Ross. I'm not though. This is Ross. There's no here I am. Like subunit commanders now. I don't think they do anything really, though. I just need to be available so I can do this and siege this uh, castle down. Defensive pact against someone's over. Source of troops, that's good. Let me reinforce my raid right after a big war. You disimprove relations with the bishop in Paris. So there's a 
temple here. Okay. Doesn't matter who we put here because it has to go under the kingdom of Norway. Search all men, my religion, my culture. Not in prison. Not a ruler. Yes, an adult. Stewardship. Titles. The Geo Orkney. Fuck off with you guys and your. Fucking these pragmatists, people who can't hold land. Fucking hate them. Fucking hate these people so much. I'm fucking fired again. Just let me grant fucking titles to people, god damn it. Seriously. Find them, it's an act of tyranny. I don't give a shit. I don't give a fuck about anything. Because you shouldn't even be pissed off about it. You should be happy because look what you're gonna get. What do you get? You get the Earl of Orkney. There was never a, there was never an issue. That's the only thing. I don't like about this, uh, this version of the game. This the council doesn't really make sense with their decision-making process. Those, especially at least the woman, the spy master woman we had. It doesn't make any sense for her to be upset about an un being unlanded because she can't be landed. I cannot land her. She's a woman. I cannot land her. I like to change that, but I can't do that either because the council also is against that. <coughs> it's whatever. I don't care. People get put back on the. I just have m multiple people who can do the job and. That's good enough for me. Seems we've actually managed to solidify our faith over here, though. We need to fix it over here. Uh, try to cause nonsense over there. I know I'm missing out on technology advancement, but I think we might be further ahead than anyone else now. 13, 13, 9. 12, 14, 13. Close. Not quite, but close. Okay, the council is dis discontent. Uh, married heir. We have all of our de jure territory now. Yes, indeed. So now, I don't have to have any regrets about feudalizing, other than I do want to make sure these are all built first. Okay, training grounds here, nothing there. This continent's a little... this uh, county is a little bit far behind. Put the training ground right there. And we will go raid for some more prestige. I have... 
78,000 men. I need uh, a little bit over 78,000, so I actually need 79 chips, but we're out of time for this episode. I hope you all enjoyed, and have a good day.